They say the power of music is helping them get through the pandemic. This group of professional musicians out of work because of the coronavirus and they took their talents to neighborhoods during the lockdowns. But as the night cams Tim Pamplin shows us, their performances are now going virtual. Welcome to West Lewiston Street in Ferndale. Typical suburban neighborhood, sort of place where the mail carrier knows everybody's name. And recently it's been home to the driveway concert series because it's good for all of our souls. And if people happen to walk by, maybe it'll lift their spirits. She's one of many local musicians out of work and looking for an avenue for her creativity. It was 37 degrees, the very first one we did. Winter coats replaced with summer dresses and shorts. Fortunately, Lewiston is full of musicians. You could have two people playing a saxophone duet across the street with each other, and then the next thing is a folk song with a person on a guitar. And as lockdown was lifted, it was clear the driveway concert series had served their purpose. And then Stacy came up with the idea. Because it's something you don't see very often, bassoon ensemble. So she contacted all of Southeast Michigan's bassoon players. There aren't that many. I'm not going to lie, it is a little bit of a weird instrument. It is. Uh... Then you call it the burping bedpost. Well, I wouldn't go that far. Back in your box, Scott. You'll often find him on stage with a DSO or in the pit at the Michigan Opera Theater. Like I say, these professional musicians, representative of so many in our region, right now simply can't give public performances. So they've turned to the internet. It's just wonderful for us to be able to collaborate virtually. It's not the same as being next to each other, but I'll tell you, it, it certainly feels good. Isn't that wonderful? Musicians getting through the pandemic the only way they know how. If you want to see this entire video, it's fantastic. Go to Click on Detroit, type in the word bassoon. I'm thinking it might be the only story we've ever done on bassoons in Ferndale. With the night camp, Tim Pamplin, Local 4.